practice of skiing as a practical means of transport across snowy areas has been around for hundreds, if not thousands of years. As a tourist attraction, however, it is much younger, but with the growth in its popularity in the last 50 years, new ski resorts have sprung up and expanded, bringing commerce to the area in which they operate. Ski resorts undoubtedly have an immense impact on their surrounding environments. Beyond the manicured slopes lie a delicate populace of plants and animals whose balance is interrupted by the impact of such resorts and the tourism they attract. A dominant factor in the displacement of plant and animal species is the construction and enlargement of ski pistes. Studies have concluded that deforesting areas to open ski runs enhances the annihilation of declining interior forest species. Construction strips an area of vegetation and exposes the soil to sediment runoff and streams. Both rope tows and gondola services involve the installation and maintenance of heavy machinery, which may disrupt local habitats. Ski pistes are maintained with snow cannons. The artificial snow created by these prolongs the ski season, leading to later and larger quantities of snowmelt that can upset the water system in the area. Snow parks, or terrain parks, are areas where a huge amount of earthworks is needed in the off-season to be able to build the big features such as jumps and half-pipes. Under the jumps will be a large amount of displaced sediment that provides the platform to build the jump and the area for the skier to land. The size of these jumps gives an idea of the large amount of sediment that is moved to facilitate this. Increasingly, snow park builders have realised that it's vital to lessen the environmental impact of a park on the mountain. So they aim to use the natural shape of the terrain to help design a park. By working with the shape of the land, not against it, park builders can reduce the amount of earthworks needed, thus limiting the impact on the mountain. It has been common practice in snow parks to salt the takeoff of a jump to ensure it freezes and holds its shape. In some resorts in the US, this has been banned as it has been found that the salt has a negative impact upon the environment. There are some aspects of ski resorts that have had negative impacts on alpine areas, but thankfully the expansion of ski resorts is usually undertaken with a certain amount of caution, as mountain culture is intrinsically linked to environmentalism.